we know that uh, I don't campers, RVs, oh, yeah. parks, state parks. I mean, a lot of those spots have been sold out for quite a long time, coming from all over for this. Park rangers, managers, they're uh, you know been gearing up for a while, just as the rest of the state has been. And, and those campers, you know, they're going to have great weather tonight, but. Tomorrow night, when those storms come in, could be more of an issue. Yes, gather firewood tonight yeah, yeah, because it good. might be wet by Absolutely. 10 o'clock tomorrow night. Mm -hmm. But uh, here's what they wanted to say about those people who uh, are going to be maybe going to and from the state parks. So here's one of the state park representatives with some more info. We have 26 park sites in the path of totality, and so we'll have welcoming staff and rangers uh, at each of those places. Every park's a little different on how it's laid out and how uh, highways and roads come into and out of the park. So we've had this awareness that cell service might be limited. So we would encourage folks to pick up a paper map, um, to have a plan, um, to understand where they are and what an alternate route might be if they need to get somewhere quickly. All right, and uh, you know, when I was growing up, we had those, uh actual maps that people put in their glove compartment. I still have one of those. Yeah, it's smart yeah. to have one. You can buy them at gas stations, travel stops, parks and rec officials, state park officials, everybody. They're recommended. Just go ahead and pick one of those up. You don't already have one in your glove compartment because you don't know how cell phone service is going to be. Everybody's going to be on their phones at the same time. So just keep that in mind. A hard copy of where you need to go. Always helpful.